New tonight, a brazen story out of Prince George, a Florida man facing charges for allegedly stealing thousands of dollars worth of diesel from a local gas station. 8 News reporter Madison Moore is there now with this story. Madison. If you take a look around me here, this is where Prince George police say that man stole $20,000 worth of diesel fuel, tampering with parts inside the pump that allowed him to get away with the hefty amount. I have not heard of this happening with so much diesel. Oliver Curry has driven semis for 15 years, and he likes to stop and get gas at the 7-Eleven just off of County Drive near Bull Hill Road in Prince George weekly. But when he heard a Florida man named Pablo Navarro was arrested at the gas station today for allegedly stealing $20,000 worth of diesel at the same pump he uses, shocked was the only word that came to mind. That is a lot of diesel, uh, with diesel being $4 a gallon, I mean, do the math. That's roughly 5,000 gallons of gas and given the large amount, Curry thinks this wasn't Navarro's first go around. I mean, $20,000 worth of diesel, it doesn't happen overnight. You know, it this thing has been adding up for some time. Navarro resides in Miami, Florida, and police tell me his intentions in Prince George are still under investigation. But this isn't the only theft that's happened at this 7-Eleven. Navarro's arrest is linked to six other similar diesel thefts. The first one was caught on camera in March, second in July, and a string of them in October and November. But how exactly did he manage to do this? Police say someone meddling with the fuel dispenser changed the sensor that reads how many gallons and how much the fuel costs. We reached out to police to gather the camera footage of the incidents, but they say it's not available at this time. But the eye in the sky doesn't lie. So if they just run the taste back, I'm pretty sure something will pop out. Now this is still an ongoing investigation and anyone with any information regarding these thefts are encouraged to contact Prince George Police Department. But for now in Prince George, Madison Moore, 8 News.